Let's make one more tutorial in Autodesk Fusion. In this video, you'll learn how to use the extrude, chamfer, and mirror. So open the Fusion and let's go. The first step to create this part, we will create these two pipe here. Okay. In the right plane, this one and this one. And we need to create a circle with 33 millimeters of geometer and another one with 35 millimeters of geometer. And in this side, you have a circle with 14 millimeters of geometer and 12 millimeters of geometer. And the distance between these two circles is 100 millimeters. And the midpoint will be here, okay? So open the fusion, go to create a sketch, select the right plane. Select the circle, click here in this point, make a circle here with 33 millimeters and another circle with 35 millimeters and make a circle here with 40 millimeters and another one with 12 millimeters. Go to sketch dimension, the distance between these circles is 100 millimeters. And go to constraint, select horizontal vertical, select this point here and the midpoint. Okay. Finish the sketch. We needed to extrude this 54 millimeters of length. So go to extrude, select this profile here and this one. And the direction, select symmetric, measurement, whole length, and the distance here 54 millimeters. Operation new body, press OK. We made this. Now, we will create this body here, OK? This part. So to create this, we'll select the right plane and make this sketch here. So we'll create a circle here, an arc here, sorry. A line here, another line here, and another arc. These lines must be tangent with the arcs, okay? And the arc has 27.5 millimeters of radius and in this side, 15 millimeters of radius. And this arc is concentric with the circle and this arc here is concentric with the circle, okay? So go to create a sketch, select the right plane, go to create, select the project include project, the selection filter, select the bodies, select this body here and this one, press OK. You can hide this body here. Now go to create and select the arc, center point arc. Click here in this point, make an arc here with 27.5 millimeters. And make another arc here with 15 millimeters of radius. Okay, we made this. Now select a line, make a line between these two points and make a line between these two points here and go to constraint, select this tangent, make this line tangent with this arc and make this line tangent with this arc. Let me erase, I made the two lines here, sorry. Make this tangent here. Tangent here and tangent here. Okay, we made this. Now finish the sketch. Show the body one and body two. We needed to extrude this 10 millimeters of distance. And here is the plane. So we'll need to make an offset. So with 15 millimeters of distance. Okay, and extrude. 10 millimeters. So let's make this. Go to extrude. Select this profile. The start here, select the offset and the distance 15 millimeters. And the distance of extrusion here is 10 millimeters. Okay. Look at this. We have 15 millimeters here, the offset, and 10 millimeters here. Operation join and press OK. Now we'll make this chamfer here with one millimeters. So go to modify, select the chamfer, select this edge here, 
one millimeters and press OK. We made this. Now to make the same body here in the other side, we'll go to create and select mirror. The object type, select the features. The object, select the extrusion here and the chamfer. And the mirror plane, select the right plane. And press OK. We made it here. Now press letter A in the keyboard to add color here. So here we finish our exercise. So thanks for watching. Subscribe my channel for more and see you in the next videos. Bye bye.